questions for Coach? All right, go Cats. <laughs> What, um, when, you, when you look at Louisville's defense on film, what, what do they do well? Uh, they're in the right places at the right time. They play really hard. Uh, it's a good looking bunch, too. Uh, we've talked to some people that have played them, and, and they, uh, they think they're physical. Um, but uh, they, just, they just know where to go, and, and they do a really good job in the back end switching up coverages. Are they doing anything differently this year compared to last year? Yeah, they're playing harder, and they're, they're uh, in the right spots. How much was last year's game kind of a fool's gold in a way? It can't be a fool's gold to the guys that you know completely dominated the team, and it's likely not going to be the case this year. Yeah, I think that you know you got to approach every game the same. We approach the exact same way as we've done this year as we did last year. You know, you can fall into a, a bad deal too uh, from the last year, and, and our kids uh, didn't allow that to happen. So, you know, they know they're a good football team, and they know it's a rivalry game, and so uh, they'll be they'll be ready to go. It's a rivalry game, so there's going to be a little bit more uh, excitement uh, before the game. How do you make sure that there isn't too much excitement? Yeah, you know what? This thing's about discipline. It, it really is. And, and the talking doesn't score touchdowns or, or, or make tackles. So it's, it's just about being disciplined and playing on the field. You know, that's when you get a really good football game, when you get a rivalry game where guys aren't using their mouth and they're, and they're just playing good football. Max has helped you out all year, um, going to give you an edge, help flip the field. But in the in the place kicking, it's been inconsistent. H how does that affect your, your play calling? Uh, you know what? Only if we're in the gray zone. You know, if we're in the gray zone, then coach will say you have four downs, and uh, you've seen us go for it a few times on fourth down. So it just depends on where he feels good about it. When Coach Hood talks to him about where he feels like he's good from, then then we're going to go for it. You know. So if you don't lose any yardage and you don't have to punt, but. You know, we're kind of in, in that those conversations at that time. Does your gray zone change, or is it no, just that kind of forty-ish? No, no it's you. Yeah, it can change absolutely. Weather, number mm -hmm. one, and then how they're doing during the week. So yeah, it does change. Uh, the NFL, they they've been going for two a lot more often. Is, does that become uh, in play? Uh, you know what? You know the, all that statistical stuff. I think in, in, in the books, uh, I, I get it. Maybe at that level, I, I'm I'm not. Uh, Cut out for that. <laughs> I just listen on the headphones. And you only play in the rain so many times this year. Do you guys almost feed on that at this point, thriving in those kind of miserable conditions? Yeah, you know what? It just really hasn't affected them, you know, because I think we have. If this would have been the first one, then I think that, you know, you get worried about it as a coach, but I don't think it's just another day at the office, it seems like. You know, you have rain and Saturday afternoon. Um, Evan, Evan had. Got to get them cranked up for this one. They're in the wrong, they're in the wrong sport. Um, yeah, you got to be, uh, you got to be ready to go. It's sort of like the Browns and the Steelers. You know, they're not going to have to get them cranked up next week. So I don't think that's going to be an issue. Getting the guys, you know, some of the young guys reps. Do you see that freshness from from the guy, you know, the ones out there? Yeah, we really do. We look fast today. We, we, we did. We had a lot of excitement. It was, uh, it was a really good practice. But they did. They looked fresh and they looked fast. So I think that really helped us the last couple of weeks. Uh, yeah, yeah, Wagner just helped flies. I mean, we haven't seen him involved a lot since he came back on the New Jersey Coastal Coast. Coast. Really good, yeah. Today, actually, you know, there was a lot of excitement out there because uh, yeah, a couple of plays were made and, and uh, action went up to him and I said, you're back. And, and so that was, that was good to see. You brought up Brown and the Steelers. One said, you know, they had his pick for you guys. Who do you think you got on the Steelers. <laughs> it's my favorite. Uh, I was Lynn Swan growing up. So I wasn't as fast as Lynn Swan. <laughs> Everybody good? Thanks. <laughs>